Hi guys, it's old. Welcome back on my channel. Happy New Year, everyone. Uh, so this week, my video is about another hair product. Uh, it's an American product, actually. Uh, it's uh, Aunt Jackie's Curls and Coil Curl Lala uh, Defining Curl Custard. It's a product that I actually started to use about five months ago. Um, it's a product that you use about once or twice a week. Uh, to uh, moisturize and uh, define your curl pattern. Basically, uh, when your hair is still wet, you can either uh, just paint your hair with it or just stick a little bit on your fingertip and take a strand of hair and just define the pattern you, uh, you have, actually have and uh, put a little bit on it so your curls will be bouncy and shiny for a couple days. Right now it's been maybe three days since the last time I've used this cream and actually my hair isn't that bad considering that, um, well, I'm really moving a lot while I sleep um, and considering too that during Canadian winters, uh, right now it's about minus 20 degrees Celsius. Um, so it's really freezing, uh, heating's up, uh, cranking up like crazy. Uh, so hair tends to be really, really, really dry and uh, kinky. So yeah, pretty good result. This product actually doesn't have any uh, silicone, parabens or uh, petroleum jelly into it. Uh, no mineral, mineral oil too. Um, it's enriched with shea butter and olive oil, and it has all, also a lot of blueberry extracts. So it really smells like a freshly baked uh, blueberry pie, at, but it's not an uh, overwhelming smell. It's really a subtle smell. So people won't get nauseous because of uh, the fragrance of that cream, and they won't smell you like... 20 miles around you. The Anjaki Curls and Coil uh, Defining Curl Cream is really budget friendly and is really a must for people with curly or uh, coils. Um, because for 10.99 uh, Canadian dollars, of course, um, you get a uh, 511 pa uh, grams uh, pot like this. Uh, since I use it only once or twice a week, um, I've been using it for five months and I'm still about like two thirds, maybe I'm at the three quarters of a pot. Yeah, maybe more two thirds. So I, I still have a lot of my way to use. Uh, and I think the pot will last me about uh, seven months. So seven months worth of product for about 11 bucks. It's really cheap. Why I wanted to try out that product? Uh, basically because, well, I saw it a lot of on Instagram and uh, I saw a lot of people uh, having really good results with that product. Uh, and also one of my colleagues uh, at my old job uh, told me that I maybe I should give it a try. Uh, because of my hair texture and because of the needs uh, I have too because my hair used to have a really high porosity um, and now it's pretty low uh, since my hair is more moisturized and more taken care of. If you want to see the final results uh, from this cream like when it's freshly applied um, you can also go on my Instagram see my publications um, most of the publication when I uh, my hair I uh, when my hair's down, um, it's when I first use. Uh, it's pretty much on the first day that I use uh, the Curlala cream, so you can get your inspiration there and see the result for yourself. The only downside I have about that product, because uh, nothing's perfect, <laughs> uh, is that when there's one spot with a little too much cream on it, it tends to make the hair all stick together in one spot like this, but over here, it does. it's not greasy as well. So when it's freshly applied, it's kind of greasy. Um, 
but it makes the hair stick together a little bit so while it's drying you really have to kind of scrunch or scratch your hair like this to make your hair uh, move a little and not stick together like this. So for the braid, since it's almost perfect, I'm gonna give it a 9.5 out of 10 because it's super budget friendly, gives really good results, uh, smells good, super easy to use, no parabens, no sulfates, no um, harsh chemicals, um, and it smells so good. It smells so good. I really love the smell of the blueberries. Um, so thanks a lot for watching. Happy New Year again. Uh, don't uh, forget to subscribe to my channel and to all my social media pages, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All the usernames are going to be in the description below. So thanks a lot for watching. Happy New Year and see you next time.